Hello there guys and welcome, welcome back to the channel. Now it's no secret that my life has been a bit bumpy recently and I definitely needed a good laugh. I was leaning towards my childhood friends and family for that, but I am extremely grateful that Kabam, well, surprisingly un or unsurprisingly, extended their helping hand to me and gave me a really, really good laugh today. And the only problem is that it still hurts a bit to laugh. But uh, today is the second out of three, you know, additions to the Caps Commissary. So we can take a look at what is new there. So the first row of offers and the second row of offers we already discussed. And then the gold offer is there. So the two new things that Kabam felt a need to have a specific release date for, which is also very odd in my opinion is the 4-star rare champion and 5-star rare champion selector. So if you tap on the I button, you can see that for 555 units, you can get a 4-star. And that's cool. Obviously, 4-stars represent exactly zero value to anybody that has played more than, you know, a month or two in a game. And 4-stars do not represent a 555 unit value to even a day one player anymore. This is, you know, objectively just a collector's offer, but when you step away from it, it is just so insanely stupid to think 555 units for a four star. Again, 555 units, that's like 20 bucks if you have to buy them. Equivalent to. Do you want to spend 20 bucks for a four star when we have seven stars? I, this is just so freaking dumb. Like, what the fuck is this? And, uh, okay, maybe you can say four stars are not for me, but I want to get a five star. Well, first thing you can notice is that there is that lock on it. And uh, in order to access it, you need to fully buy out the four star <laughs> champion selector bundle to access this one. <laughs> you need to fully buy... You need to spend... 2,200... I'm not making this shit up and I am trying to keep my shit together. You need to spend 2,000... Oh, wait. Yeah, whatever. You need to spend over 2,000 units to have the privilege to spend another 1,000 units to get a five star when five stars are obsolete. Gabon is throwing five stars at everybody's rectums left, right, and center. Gabon is throwing six stars at, you know, Thronebreakers and Paragons at everybody's left and right butt cheeks as well. But to even have the great, gracious opportunity to, you know, get a five star Thanos or a Vision. You need to basically spend an Odin, because you need to spend 2,000 plus units on the 4 stars, and then 1,000 plus units here, so an Odin for a 5 star. Like, what the fuck? Uh, who the fuck? Uh, I'm seriously, but who the fuck? It's not often I'm speechless, but I can't possibly find intricate and verbal expressions that would fully explain the level of stupidity and moronic disposition that somebody must possess. The level of self-grandeur and delusion thinking that somebody is going to pay $100, equivalent in units, for a bunch of four stars and a five... Are you fucking mental? Like, do you need, like, a checkup? Does somebody need, like, do, do you guys have a working professional ensuring mental stability in that backdoor garage company? I mean, like, we have established that, you know, it's 50-50 shot that Kabam is based at some soccer mom's garage at this point, and it's actually three dudes working on the game. My question is, is the soccer mom a qualified, you know, therapist? Because she better be, because <laughs> somebody needs it. I mean, sweet mother of God, in the name of everything that's unholy, what kind of abomination is this shit? 
Oh my god, it hurts so much, but it's so fucking funny. Like, who does this? It's like a five-year-old with a crayon could draw. Oh my god, a five-year-old with a crayon would have a better comprehension of a value of money. Right? He might go buy, you know, I don't know, hundred dollars worth of Cheetos, but at least he would have hundred dollars worth of fucking Cheetos. Jesus Christ. You have to be so full of your own shit to put this type of crap in game. Oh my god! Maybe it's just me though. Maybe it's just me. Maybe, you know, near-death experiences have shifted my grasp on reality and I, I, I can't understand anything, so... Um, well, let's check what the forums have to say. Maybe it's better. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm just the Mr. Negative. <laughs> Maybe, you know, oh, KT1 milking the hate clicks again, or whatever the losers say. Okay. Right. <laughs> the, the new deal in the store today is laughable. This thread derailed as well. We have pathetic. It was about this event. Pretty bad event. <laughs> Crap commissary event. Caps commission is one of the worst events ever. Uh, looking spicy, and this thread has completely... <laughs> Aged like milk. <laughs> oh, fuck a bomb. Jesus Christ. I can't even be mad at this because it's this is so bad I can't even get angry. Like this that's the level of shit that you have in front of you. It's kind of like imagine if Kabam's releasing a new champion but it has like Super Mario graphics, like from the you know the the yellow cartridge game. <laughs> From the 8-bit games, the next champion is like <laughs> just a collection of like 80 cubes <laughs> colored different. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> yeah, but okay, so let, let's check out the most... <laughs> uh, what is the new deal in store today? Is it error because my god is terrible? Please redact the offer and make certain how do I... Oh my god! I don't know th who thought it was a good idea to add foreign four star champions to this store for units. Just another example how out of touch Kabam is with its players. <laughs> I don't care how rare those champions are, it's not worth the cost of points earned. <laughs> I think there was also an important uh, thing pointed out uh, in this, because these bundles also give you very, very little points for the went. For you to try and get the seven star crystal or seven star steel warrior, and and that's also horrible because effectively six thousand six hundred sixty six units for less than two hundred points towards the solo event, which means that it's around two hundred dollars worth of units for less than two hundred points in an event where you need four thousand five hundred points. Like what the fuck, like. I mean, somebody, like, okay, so let's think here. Let's put together, guys. Somebody must have been getting fired, and they were purposely thinking, like, the stupidest, most laughable offer that you can design before leaving as a final F you to company. I mean, that's my, you know, most plausible story. That would be my storyline if I'd had to bet on it, because I don't like to attribute... Well, typically I don't like to attribute malice where incompetence can explain things, but there are le there are levels of incompetence that, you know... Because somebody have to approve this shit. Somebody can be incompetent enough to, you know, design and propose something like this, but for this to be live in-game, there had to be a series of delusional people who are, again, you know, spoon-feeding spoon each other their own feces, basically. Because it had to go chain of approval. Somebody had to work on it, somebody had to approve it, somebody had to put it in the game, and nobody of those people said, like, wait, this is, you know, bad. Jesus Christ. <laughs> now, I can, however, say, with absolute certainty, 27th of September, I will be monitoring these offers like a hawk because we are supposed to get something more 
in this Caps Commissary on 27th. 27th of September. I will be glued to my phone. Because this shit's hilarious. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, Mary and Joseph. And I hate taking Lord's name in vain. Therefore, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that, but fuck me sideways. Oh my god. And again, I can't even be mad. I can't be mad. This is so abysmally shit that it's, you know, fucking hilarious. <laughs> At least let me know what you guys think. Catch you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Hello there guys and welcome back to the channel. So we have all the information about